Hello, my name is Michael Fudge, and I'm here to demonstrate how to open your terminal window on your OS X Mac computer in your Git repository folder. You'll need to know how to do this before you can execute any of the Git commands, as they only work from inside a repository folder. A Git repository is a special folder you create with the git init command or by cloning another repository, typically from GitHub. Opening up the terminal window in this folder is usually a common practice before starting your coding session. Here's the procedure. First, we want to open up Finder. My repository is in the Documents folder. Inside the Document folder, you'll see that it says Learn Python MA Fudge. This is my folder. Now I want to open up a terminal window in this folder. So I go up here to the Finder menu, and under Services, it says New Terminal at Folder. I select that and then I get my terminal window. If for some reason you don't see the new terminal at folder menu, like if I go back to finder here, and I go up here, and I don't see this new terminal at folder, what you should do is go down here to service preferences and turn it on. And the way you turn it on is under service preferences. If you scroll down, you'll see that it's an option, new terminal at folder, and you check the checkbox. And then when you close this, it will then show up. Now when you're at the terminal, to check and see that you're in the Git repository, you just type in git status from the command line. When you type in git status, it should say something like you see on my screen. If it says something like, this is not a Git repository, then you're obviously in the wrong place. It should have these three messages in here. It'll usually say on branch master. That tells you where you what current branch you're on in Git. It'll also say something like your Git branch is up to date with origin master. It could also be ahead or behind origin master. Origin master is the remote version of that repository. Usually it's on GitHub. And then lastly, it'll show you which files are different than the ones you've last committed in to Git. At this point, my working directory is clean, which means the files in this folder match what Git is tracking. Well, that's it. For more on Git, be sure to check out my Git overview video in this playlist. Bye now.